Hi guys, it's Rachel and I'm so sorry I haven't made a video in like two months. I'm really sorry. But now that the cross country season is over, I can actually make videos because I have a life outside of cross now. Because every day I'd wake up at 6.30, no not 6.30, at 6, get to school at 7, be there until what like seven doing cross country and then I would have student council meetings after that and then I'd get home and I'd have homework and I'd do dinner and I'd go to bed and I seriously did not have any time and I'm so sorry about that but cross country's over now so I can hopefully have a little bit more time to make stuff like this because I know a lot of you guys have messaged me like Rachel where are you but I'm finally back and I decided that today, since I have been gone for like two months, I am just going to update you guys on everything that has been happening in my life. Um, I guess I'll start with the eating disorder stuff first. Um, I'm still an outpatient. I'm still seeing my same therapist once every, once a week. Um, I don't know. I'm getting kind of tired of it. Getting really tired of it, actually. But... My mom wants me to keep going, so I'm like, whatever. I just kind of sit there the whole time and not talk. I'm just be like, shoot me. But, um, that kind of sucks. And I just realized that my closet is open. And on October 11th, it was my one year anniversary of being out of Rogers. I was admitted October 11th, 2011. I've been out of there for more than a year now. Hallelujah. So... Yep, I've been out of Rogers. I'm an outpatient now, and I hate it, but I suck it up and I deal with it. Um, my weight is pretty stable. I recently lost a little bit of weight, but I'm doing, like, okay. And obviously, body image is still crap. You guys know me, it's always been crap, and it probably always will be, but... That's my problem. <laughs> um, but... One thing that I have... I have um, made, I guess, my motto now is, um, what's the point of having anorexia in your life? Like, I've just been asking myself lately, like, what's the point? I'm going to live, I'm just going to be here for, like, I don't know, however many years, and then I'm going to heaven. Like, why waste it obsessing about my body or how much I ate? I'm really sorry I'm futzing with my hair, but why waste it obsessing about my body or, like, wasted in hospitals. Go out and live. I mean, that's what I've been trying to tell myself. I mean, have fun. It's high school. Don't be cooped up in a hospital all the time. Do something with your life and make it productive. Don't just starve yourself the whole life. That's what I've been telling myself a lot lately, and I think it's really actually helped. But, yeah, the eating disorder stuff is okay, pretty much normal. Um, high school is awesome! I love it so much. I have so many friends now, and it's so much better than grade school. I love high school. It's just a blast, to be honest. I love it so much. Um, that's all going well. I made it on the honor roll. Rachel is smart. Um, I'm on student council. Um, I'm in the school musical. Um, obviously cross country and other stuff like that and yeah I really enjoy it and speaking of school guess what guys Rachel has a boyfriend ah! today is our one month anniversary October 6th is the day we started dating his name is Kyler he's a sophomore he's 16 Really, really sweet guy. I mean, he really, like, makes me feel better about myself, and I don't know. He's just super sweet, and I really, I really like this kid, so we'll see how that goes. Um, and if you guys are going to ask, no, we have not had our first kiss yet. <laughs> but, um, so I have a boyfriend that's going well. Um, for parents and stuff... I have not talked to my dad in a really long time. Yeah, you're going to be like, Rachel, you guys live in the same house. Have you, how have you not talked to him in a really long time? But, like, we normally just, like, keep our distance. Like, we just we just aggravate each other. So, I guess it's been kind of mutual. Like, I'm not going to talk to you and you're not going to talk to me. And I'm okay with that. 
Um, my mom and I were doing okay, I would say. Um, not the greatest, but okay. I've gotten very close to my sister recently. Um, I'm not really sure how because like I've said in the past, like we don't we haven't really talked, but um all of a sudden we've been getting really close and I don't know, it's been nice to like get to know her better. Um is that all I have for you guys? I feel like I've talked really fast, but that's all I have for you guys today, I think. Um, I want you guys to like this video, um, subscribe, and I wa want you guys to comment down below um, about what kinds of videos you guys want to see since I'll actually be able to make some now that Cross is over. So please, comment spam me down below of what you guys want to see. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!